Hi there, I'm Robert. And I'm Laura. We are the Suburban Preppers. In today's video, we are going to discuss... A Army 24-hour ration pack. Yes, a British Army 24-hour ration pack. So we have here one standard issue British Army ration pack. It is menu 5 24-hour ration pack GP. I assume that means general purpose, I don't know. If somebody else knows, you can let us know. So yeah, um, it's quite a, oops, quite a weighty <laughs> little bag. So yeah, Laura, why don't you open that up and we'll have a look what's inside. Yeah. Right, so we've just emptied the, the pack out. We've kind of organized it into little bits. So we'll start with the main meals. Main meals. Like I say, this was menu five. And there are 10 different menus, so this is just one of them. Each one has different contents. So meal number one would be fruitful muesli with milk. Add 100 ml of water, mix well, leave to stand for one minute before consuming. Next main, main meal please, Laura. So the next one is pasta bolognese. Um, this one has 400 and 98 calories per serving uh, it's 300 gram pack and it says it can be consumed hot or cold for best results place product in boiling water for eight to ten minutes then open mix and consume no our pasta bolognese doesn't have a best before did must mean it lasts forever <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah so the the thing with these main meals is they're designed to be eaten hot or cold so yeah so that was laura's pasta bolognese <clears throat> And the, the next meal is halal sweet and sour chicken with rice. So this one here, it has calories per 100 gram and it's a 300 gram packet, 134 calories. So around about 400 calories or so, give or take. Yeah. So yeah, that is another main meal. Obviously you can choose whether you have it for your lunch or your, your dinner. You know, it's, it's up to you or not have lunch. Have, have two meals for dinner but again the the same instructions as the one that you had what did you have pasta bolognese, pasta bolognese. same instructions as a pasta bolognese snacks you pick a snack just the one closest to us so this is a cookies and cream flavor bar so let's have a look it doesn't say like if it's a Okay, type bar or yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I just see. have a... Oh, there's like a so I've watched a few videos of people opening ration packs and this feels a little bit like the Rice crispy Marshmallow mm -hmm. bars. Uh, the Rice crispy Squares, is that what they're called? Mm -hmm. Feels a little bit like that. As far as I'm aware, you can get the cookies and cream flavoured bar and then you can get a, a protein bar as well. This one isn't the protein bar. So I'm sorry for stealing it off you, just while I fondled your bar. But yeah, cookies and cream flavoured bar. I suspect Rice Krispies like mm -hmm. type bar. Puffed corn or something like that. Maybe. Yeah, everyone knows them as Rice Krispies. Yeah. So since I stole your last one, I'll let you do the next one. <laughs> so the next one we'll have is some cheddar cheese flavour spread. Um, this is 48 grams. And the best before date is the 1st, 2026, so January 2026. I'm going to assume they probably put the same sort of best before dates on everything yeah. in the pack. I assume. I don't know. I might be wrong. So it says <clears> instructions for use need pack before opening. Obviously, it feels quite hard. So I'm assuming you want to try and melt it. Soften it up. Soften it up, yeah. And then it says spread on biscuits. <clears throat> Or eat out of the sachet. Can I just reach over and pinch that? So with that, this is the biscuits brown. Um, those are broken biscuits. Again, I've got no military experience, so I'm just going off what I've read or seen in other videos. You would use the cheese to go onto these to have essentially a bit like a cheese and crackers type thing. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you know different, please do let us know in the comments below. Obviously, like I say, myself and Laura have zero military experience. We've never had to eat any of these in the wild before. So, 
Yep, we'll I'll pop these into the bag. Please, uh, Laura. One, yeah, oh, my apologies. Per 100 grams is 435 calories. So roughly for this, it's about half the calories of what's in there because it's 48 grams. Plus it's 270 calories. I don't know. This one I can't see. Oh, there's 84 grams. And it, again, it's, it's got per 100 grams, which I think is pretty useless in my own personal opinion. I think this should tell you the calories, what's mm -hmm. in there, what's in there, what's in there, what's in it. Yeah. Not per 100 grams, because if you're a bit slow like I am, you know, you can't add them up. You can't say, oh, well, that's only whatever. You know, you, you, you might get that totally wrong and miscalculated. Mm -hmm. I mean, with that in mind, though, these packs are generally high calories. Yeah. I can't remember if they contain... It's either 3,000 or 4,000 calories. Obviously, a soldier on active service is going to be very active. Mm -hmm. They're not going to be... Well... Maybe not sitting around doing nothing yeah. and putting on weight. Yeah, they're well, going to be. Depending if they're in the cold, they might yeah. need. They'll need yeah, they're going to be marching and stuff. Well, with you saying with the cold, we also have in the British Army an Arctic Russian pack as well. So, moving on, I'm going to reach over. I'll take this one. Orange flavored cake. Yeah, again, best before 2026. At the time of recording, we are September 2024. October. October 2024. It's the start of October. It's only just changed. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, it feels just like orange sponge cake. I don't want to open them up. Um, yeah. It's quite soft. So. If I open them up, obviously then we need to use them. Yeah. So they're no good for preps then. But, like I say, it feels a bit like orange sponge cake. It's got the best before date. It's got package date. I assume it again somewhere. It'll have calorie information. But... So, we'll pop that in there. The next thing we've got is just fruit. That is literally what it says, just fruit. 75 grams worth. It's got raisins, sultanas, sweetened cranberries... Um, which is cranberries, pineapple juice from concentrate, pineapple syrup and sunflower oil. And then it also has sunflower oil and cottonseed oil. So I'm, I'm assuming like a, a mixed dried fruit. Yeah. Do you know the raisin sultanas and whatnot? Yeah. And again, this one says <clears throat> it's 100 grams per nutritional information per 100 grams, but there's 75 grams in it and it has 332 calories. And a best before date of 2026. Some of the months are different though. Like oh yeah, fifth. okay, fair enough, yeah. So... But then the next snack that Laura's also picking up, no, no, you can pick it up, it's fine, is salted peanuts. Um, I would say probably to complement the, the fruit because you can have yeah. fruit and nut. Mm. Or you can have one snack at one point and the peanuts at a different point. Whatever whatever you, you choose to do, you know, it's... It's your life. <laughs> There's 50 grams in this bag. And these will be quite high calorie. 635 calories per 100 grams. So again, you would half that. So something like 370 calories. Yeah. So, yeah, so that's the food items all done. Next, we have the drinks and the sundries pack. Drinks and sundries. Fortified energy drink powder with flavour. Which flavour is it? Strawberry. Oh, hold on. Apple. My apologies. I just read the instructions on the back, the, the writing on the back rather. But at the top it's got apple and then it's got peach, strawberry. So <laughs> my eyes were drawn at the strawberry one first of all. I got it totally wrong. It tells you on the bottom, apple. So it is an apple flavoured energy drink. I assume possibly going to be like a, a LucasAid Sport. Like a... If, do you know, a drink a bit like, like that? Nice tonic. Yes, that, yeah, that's the word. I couldn't think of the word. Um, so I think oh, if that was American, it would be like Gatorade, maybe? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yes, so apple flavoured fortified energy drink with flavour. <laughs> apple flavour. <laughs> Next. 
We and have. This one says fruit flavour, sorry, fruit flavour drink powder. Um, instructions of use. Mix contents of one sachet into a cup and add 500 mils of water to taste. I'm just going to interrupt. I didn't check for the fortified apple drink, but it's the same. I'm just looking on the front of these. Um, yeah, I think these are pretty much all the same. So yeah, what have you got there? Yeah, different flavours. So this one says lemon flavour and grapefruit flavour. No, it, it oh. tells you on the bottom. Oh, right, so it's, okay. So this is grapefruit flavour. That's flavor. a mistake I made just before and I thought it was strawberry. Yeah, I thought they were mixed. So this one is pineapple flavour. And... Peach? Uh, oh, no, pear. Pear. So we've got... What was yours, sorry? Grapefruit. Grapefruit, pineapple and pear flavoured drinks. Mm, yummy. So with these and the other one, it would make two litres in total of a flavoured drink. It, it's better than plain water, I suppose, you know, so... But then we, what have we got over here? This is a little sachet of uh, spicy red chilli sauce. Like a bit hot sauce. Yeah, so I'm yeah. assuming it's to go on one of the meals. Maybe? Would you have it with the pasta bolognese or the sweet and sour chicken? I think probably the pasta bolognese. I don't know either. Oh. But... There you go then. The voice of authority has spoken. <laughs> Even if she is wrong. <laughs> so yes, um, hot sauce, that is optional. You can or cannot have it. You could maybe mix it in with the spread cheese. Some waterproof matches and a striker. And six water purification tablets. Each one of these filters, uh, excuse me, does not filter. It purifies one litre of water. You would have to filter the water before you pur purified it. So we'll pop them in, and then we have our sundries pack and a hot drink over here. So we'll just open this. This is like a, a press press lock bag, so you can reseal it, save the contents getting wet. We have a spork. Seems quite a quite a good one as well. I mean, it's not going to be a mm. one that you can use Plastic for one. weeks and weeks and weeks. It's not like the camping shop yeah. quality one, but it's it's. It's Which slightly better fall. quality than, than the disposable cutter, yeah. isn't it? Mm -hmm. It would probably do you to eat all, all of the meals. Yeah. yeah. So, would you pop the items back into the bag as we go through them, please? Thank you. Just keep it all tidy. Next, we have some tissues. Let's see. Wipe a runny nose or runny something else. These appear to be the same... Alcohol-free antibacterial wipes times two. Two antibacterial wipes. Next. Chewing gum. Chewing gum. So, is it sugar-free? Just quickly. Probably not for the calories. Yes, it is. It's a sweetener one. Don't need too much, or you'll need your tissues. Six pieces are... Uh, I think I can feel inside. Sugar-free gum, if you eat too much, has a laxative effect. So. <clears throat> wonder what flavour it is. I'm going to assume just mint. So, while Laura's examining the pack, the has got a flavour, or, <laughs> or not. So, we have the one that wasn't in the pack. Hot chocolate flavoured drink. Just seeing if it has any... Directions for use in a half a litre of water again. So, a cup of hot chocolate. Got a tiny bit of powder in there. Yeah, quite a lot of powder for half a litre of water, mm -hmm. yeah. So, two tea bags, just regular tea. Two instant coffee sachets, freeze dried coffee. Four whiteners. I'm going to assume one for each of your, your drinks. Two for the tea, two for your coffee. And then four sugars, again, if you have sugar in your drink. Enough for one for each drink. There's seems to be a, a good portion of sugar in, in there, so maybe that's like the equivalent of two sugars mm -hmm. or whatever. 
you could also have one of these perhaps in the in the porridge in the oats yeah. do you know if you needed to sweeten it mm -hmm. so that is the contents of menu five of the british army 24 hour gp ration pack so that's the end of the video thank you for watching bye for now see you later